Today, I'm going to show you how the cutter, that's right, the cutter, the weapon that you start the game with, is actually the best weapon in the game, and no, it's not focusing the laser. I'm going to show you secret techniques that will make it the absolute best weapon ever. Here's what we're going to cover. How to make the cutter kill anything in seconds. And the hardest enemies, the highest HP enemies, it does not matter. Everything melts to this weapon, and showing its overall damage potential. So let's begin. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to spawn a Terramorph, the strongest alien in the game, right here. There's a Terramorph. Oh, man. It's only, it says it's level 10, but trust me, these things are the tankiest enemies you're going to face. Now, I want you to look at its HP, right? I'm just going to stop shooting it and just look at its HP drain. It's dead. It's already dead. Now, I'm going to spawn another one, and I'm going to show you the most powerful weapon in the game and how it compares. This is the Magstorm. It is known, it is normally the most powerful weapon in the game. I've got to reload it and look at its HP bar. Not even half. I did not even deal half the damage to it. So here's another full 160 bullets. Still not dead. All right. And it's spitting on me now. So there we go. We killed it. Now, how about a regular weapon? So there we go. Let's, uh, let's pull out a grenade launcher. Look at this. It's barely hurting this thing. Okay. Uh, the... <laughs> How about a regular weapon? Now, this weapon deals bonus damage to aliens, so you would think it would be good against this guy, but it's not. Like, it, I am barely hurting this thing. If you don't have super weapons, you're not killing a Terror Morph. The missions in the game that require you to fight a Terror Morph have options to run away or a bunch of, like, environmental things to help you kill it. You're not meant to just pull out the cutter and then kill it in a few seconds. I'm not, remember, I'm not using the focus laser. I'm just sitting here holding left click on it, and uh, this thing is just going to absolutely melt. There we go. And I don't know why someone's laughing. That's just part of the game's code. Now, I'm going to summon another Terror Morph, and I'll, I'll focus the laser this time to show you that it doesn't matter. Yeah, I'm dealing six more damage, you know, per second. Well, it's melting this one a little bit, but I'm going to explain now what's happening. Why did this die so fast? Let me teach you the secret to making the cutter. And this works on every enemy in the game. It's not just Terror Morphs. Terror Morphs aren't magically weak against laser beams. And speaking of lasers, that's the secret. By leveling lasers to level 4, they have a 5% chance to set the target on fire. Now, what's, what being set on fire does in this game is it deals a percent of your total HP as fire damage. And I'll, I'll, I'll even demonstrate. We're going to summon another Terror Morph. And I've got a, I've got a regular laser rifle here. This it deals laser damage, and it, there you go. It's on fire. It's dealing 77, 78, 79 tick damage. And uh, you can see that it's not just draining its health. I can sit here and fire into this thing. And yeah, I'm hitting it pretty hard and, and borrowed, but um, you can see that it didn't just melt. Now, what's going on with the cutter is this applies damage over time, or it hits multiple times a second. So... Because of that, it's stacking the fire. So you can see here, like, its HP is just melting, right? The three damage is not what's killing it. It's the fire damage being stacked on it, like, 10 to 20 to 50 times. So it's taking 79 fire damage 50 times a second. That's why the cutter absolutely melts this thing. And, you know, we can just keep melting them, too. Just sit here and uh, hold the cutter, and once it catches on fire... Uh, you know, again, it's 5% chance, but because the cutter is literally hitting it like 50 times a second, it's, uh, it, it just melts. It just dies. This works on every single enemy in the game, and all you need is lasers level 4. That is what makes the cutter super insanely powerful. There is nothing else in the game that does this. You can get a laser shotgun and just pump and pump and pump into these things, and it will never catch on fire as much. You can add inc incineration bullets to uh, like a mag storm here, right? You can make this deal fire damage and it will not stack up nearly as fast as a cutter. And, and you get the, the cutter at the start of the game. You always have it with you for, you know, scanning things and mining things. So that's it. You don't have to put points into anything else. You just need level four lasers. You can ignore the entire rest of this tree. You don't need armor penetration. You don't need sharpshooting. So you can go and put all your points elsewhere and just completely destroy the entire game killing the hardest enemies in the game no problem even on new game plus i'm by the way i'm on very hard i just want to show you i am on very hard difficulty okay and it does not matter that uh, those things are level 10 they're still scaled to deal crazy crazy amounts of damage um like i can even spawn one and i don't know the code for this i think maybe that is 
Uh, nah, that's, uh, hold on. Whatever, I don't know the code to spawn them at level 1000, but it, it doesn't change their HP for whatever reason. Anyway, that's the video. <laughs> if you want to be, <laughs> you know, a, a DPS god, just use the cutter and level 4 lasers. It's that simple. I don't know if this is intended or not, but this works on humanoids, robots. Again, the targets don't matter. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Soul Benji. I appreciate it. Please leave a like before you go. Make sure you comment because I read every comment. And finally, on the right side of your screen is a video you should absolutely click. If you don't click it, then you're going to wake up one day, and if you have a pet, there's going to be puke or crap on the ground, and you're going to have to clean it up. I'm sorry, but uh, that's just how it is. It's going to minorly inconvenience you, so make sure you click it.